Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the Telstra locker room. I think it was a five-goal second quarter which set up the win for the boys today. Suns really did put into a bit of a grind in that third quarter, but the boys hang on in the last, and I think there's two or three players who set a real standard early, and we're going to talk to one of them now, Lukey Shuey. So, Lukey Shuey, hey, congratulations, mate. That was a real grind in the, in the third quarter, but I thought the energy and the, the intent in the first quarter and a bit by you boys through the midfield made such a difference. Yeah, it felt like that first half we were um, back to playing our best footy and doing what we probably haven't done for a couple of weeks and that's just really cracking at the contest and um, put your head over the footy and it sounds simple but sometimes you can go away from that and um, that's hurt us over the last couple of weeks but I think we got that right tonight. And I think to typify that too, mate, is that there's probably five or six of you through the middle had 10 or 11 or 12 tackles. So that sort of pressure was super important. They did break away, but you knew you could hang on. Yeah, yeah, we did. We, we believe that um, we can hang on against anyone. And um, I think Elliot Yo's pressure was outstanding. Jack Redden wasn't getting a lot of it early, but his pressure and his, his, um, his frontal pressure to force him to handball back and to get a couple of smothers was, was exactly what we need from our midfielders. And um, I thought it was probably our best collective effort tonight for a while. Good answer, mate. Congratulations. Well done. Look forward to Saints next week. Good, Good on you. Cheers, boots. We might just see if we can grab... Here's Brad Shepard. Shep, it was a really good win, mate, and set up in that first half. And you boys down back, I thought, set the standard. It was cleaner. They were under pressure. And a five-goal second quarter. Just give you a bit of a breather at half-time. Yeah, absolutely. I thought the way we played footy in the first half was really pleasing. Um, I think we really complied um, team defence and really got an offensive style of transition from the back half into the forward 50 a lot better. So the connection was definitely there, but probably all built from sort of the contest and um, the ability to apply pressure on the oppo. So it was a really good first half and then understanding that Gold Coast were going to come yeah. back and um, there's a bit of a grind there. Conditions got a little bit slippery, but the way we sort of fought it out... Um, yeah, really pleasing to get on the winner's board. And Shep, I thought I said to Bootsy Shuey that the intent and the energy from everyone was up. Uh, lots of double-figure tackles through the middle of the ground. So that, that just shows the importance of having the right mindset. Yes, it is. You're spot on there. It's all about mindset. Um, you can do as much training throughout the week on tackling that, or you can do as little. It's all about the, between the years in terms of uh, the tackling and pressure you apply on the oppo. I thought the guys really brought it tonight, and uh, it's a stepping stone to um, hopefully... The big game next week against St Kilda at Marvel Stadium, the first of the year playing there. So really looking forward to the challenge again. Well done, mate. I know you're really sore. Thanks for your time, buddy. Yeah, Thank you, Brad Shepard. See if I can just grab one more. Okay, we've got Elliot. Yoey, can I just grab you for a minute, mate? In all honesty, not just you here, but I thought your example, the intent and the energy you showed in that first quarter and a half, early in the first quarter, not getting a lot of it, but you're tackling your aggression. The boys could see that, and I think that's what set the scene for particularly the second quarter when you kick five goals. Oh, no, we did. Yeah, I was going to say, geez, I'd be happy with that. But, uh, yeah, look, it was one of those ones where we knew they were going to come out pretty hard and uh, the contest was probably one of the things we had to work on. And, and as much as, you know, it's frustrating not trying to get, you know, not getting the possessions or anything like that, um, you just got to try and play your role. And sometimes, you know, it'll, it'll all click. And, um, you know, very thankful that, you know, in the last it all did. And through the week, you said you're probably just a smidgen off. I reckon you're a smidgen in front now because your effort to continue through with that intent, last quarter, critical goal. So you've got to be pleased with your game. Yeah, look, it's one of those things where I've felt like, you know, uh, I've been building and obviously coming off a, li a limited pre-season, it's been um, pretty difficult as well. So, look, it's just been one of those ones where uh, just trying to get, you know, myself into form and, and running myself into the ground as much as possible. And obviously it all starts with the contest. Congratulations, mate. Well done. You're back. All right. Jeez, Good mate. on you, Elliot. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Ladies and gentlemen, that's it from us down here in the Telstra locker room. Look forward to seeing you in a couple of weeks' time when we take on the Demons. Good night.